Simleys, it's Delicacy here with Let's Play The Sims for Scream Sorority Part 7. And we're at the Dean and Professor's house. Well, I'm going to say it's the Dean's house, but it's obviously their household. And they're getting a little bit close and comfortable. Uh, the Dean does like a very uh, nice looking specimen of a male Sim. And oh, doesn't he look dreamy? Look at those eyes. And you know what? I'm sure she's kind of twisted his arm a little bit. Uh, some extra paychecks if he, uh, you know, woohoo's with her and provides her with some romantic satisfaction. So, <laughs> Professor Hottie was probably also hired because Dean Kisser felt like kissing him. Now, let's get the Dean to make a little bit of a move on him. Maybe not uh, shoe from hot tub, but maybe we might ask for a massage. Will they massage whilst in the hot tub? I think they do. Oh, hot damn, they're skinny dipping. This is kind of gross. <laughs> he seems so much younger than she is. Ew, what are you touching? What are you doing? <laughs> okay, we might also we'll get her to make a move on him. He's like, oh, I don't know about this. And we might get her to hmm, maybe snuggle. She's pretty keen. But she didn't want to snuggle. Come on. Or blow a kiss. <laughs> I wonder how much extra she pays him. Or maybe she'll give him a pay rise and a promotion if he if he pretends to love her. <gasps> Let's have a first kiss. I want to kiss in the hot tub though. Can't we have our first kiss in the hot tub? Gonna have to get out. Oh, and they won't be skinny dipping. How upsetting. That's all right. But once they have their first kiss, then we can uh, do some other things. <laughs> He's such a sexy sim. Oh my gosh. <gasps> da -da -da! I love her dorky hat. <laughs> well, actually, it's not dorky hat. It just looks dorky on her. Fedora is a styling. Oh, uh, maybe let's not try baby, but let's have a, let's have their first ever woohoo. <gasps> yes, do it. She's like, I'll give you $500. <laughs> it's like, I want a little bit of this, a uh, little bit of that. What does that say? Foppel. What? You can't woohoo in the bush. What do you mean? Maybe they can't get to it. Okay. Uh, woohoo in bush. Can we woohoo in the spa? Let's do that. Let's just get back in here. Here we go. Let's not try for a baby. We've already got a baby in this LP. So let's get them into here and they can have a little bit of a, a little bit of a hanky panky in the spa. Oh, that's kind of cute. It's kind of sweet. She reminds me of someone I know. I can't put my finger on it. Oh, does she remind you guys of anyone? I love watching Sims Woohoo. It's so much fun. <gasps> oh my god. Ew. <laughs> oh, the, look at all the hearts. Why? <laughs> I love it how she uses her fingers like, come over this way. Can we see them? I don't think so, but we can see all the love hearts. She's definitely directing all of this. She's telling him what to do. The old women, woman knows how to take charge and get what she wants. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Well, I mean, good on them, good on them. But I would say that a lot of the girls have a very big crush on Professor Hottie as well, especially Peach. We know Peach is into him. Sorority house, we have Romy and Desiree hanging out on the couch with Nadia, who looks like she's put on a little bit of weight since she got that mysterious cupcake machine. Um, she's wearing track pants because 
that's all that fits me right now. If you guys have seen Mean Girls and yeah, I don't know. She's looking good. She's looking curvy. She's got pretty big jugs as, uh, as I do say in Mean Girls as well. When Regina George puts on weight after Katie uh, tells her that the chocolate bars she has helped her lose weight when actually it makes you put on weight like crazy. Okay, so I'm thinking what we should do is actually call up Taj because we haven't spoken to Taj for a little while. Oh, Taj is here. Did I already invite him over? Oh, wow. Boy rocks up even before we call him. <laughs> well, that is a good thing. So Taj is here and oh my gosh, it's such a skis. Oh, Nadia looks a little bit jealous. Look at her. She's just like, um, <laughs> you know what, Remy? You should go to the gym. You're, you're, you're looking a little bit chubby these days. Yeah, you should totally go. So I can spend time with Taj. Look at her, she's like crazy. She's playing the victim. You know, since her boyfriend Chad died, she's been pretty devastated and she's probably thinking, well, who am I gonna move on to next? And she's probably super jealous of Romy because Romy has Taj after her and I don't know, Taj looks pretty interested in Nadia. So maybe she would like to get him to get with her. Look at him, he is such a skis. Stop flirting with everything that moves. Romy's like, okay, I'm gonna go to the gym. Maybe we'll, we'll get them to hold hands just before she goes. And Nadia might invite Taj to stay over for a little bit longer. Oh, is Romy feeling a bit sassy? Look at that walk. I almost feel like she's a bit annoyed at what just happened with Nadia and Taj. I don't blame her though. She's gonna go eat, go drink her milk outside. Yeah, she wants to speak with him in private and maybe just be like, what was that? What just happened just there? Totally, totally. What should we say to her? Although she'd be too scared to stay up to Nadia, stand up to Nadia. So maybe she'll just kind of compliment Chahaj, flirt a little bit and express his fondness, her fondness. And you know, her probably way of doing things isn't manipulating people. She'd rather just be really nice to everyone and just get in by himself and spend a little bit of time together that way. I think Nadia will also want him to stay. So she'll probably, um, Oh, I love Peach. Let's give her a compliment. Peach is probably Nadia's favorite BFF right now. Uh, but what we'll do is, because Nadia is such a bish, we'll also go tell her, go tell, we'll go get her to wake up Ecclesley and be like, take Romy to the gym, go with her because you're putting on weight too and you guys need to be in shape to be in my sorority house. God, she's so mean, she's so mean. Oh, these two are kind of getting along. These two have a similar taste. Like they're both a little bit more edgy than the other girls who are more kind of just feminine. Oh, Taj, you're washing up the sinks. Nadia probably told him to do that. And Peach is just like, well, oh, thanks Taj. Uh, okay, so let's get the girls to go to the gym. Once Nadia wakes up Elkie, like, what are you doing? You're meant to be ironing all my clothes. <laughs> Just tell Elkie who is pregnant. Oh my God, she's gonna have the baby soon. I don't even know what we're gonna do with that baby. We might, uh, instead of sharing our own insecurities, we might just be a little bit mean to her, insult her and be like, go to the gym, go with Rummy. You guys need to work out. Okay, let's watch this insult. And really, she probably feels like she needs to go to the gym. Oh, Elkie's like a match for her. Go to the gym, take Romy, and Romy's looking annoyed as well. They're all getting a little bit annoyed at Nadia, I feel like. Okay, now the girls are at the gym, let's get Nadia to quickly go upstairs and put something on, which will probably impress Taj a little bit more. Put something a little bit sexy on that shows off a little bit of skin, if you know what I mean. And she's gonna go downstairs and then try and hook up with Taj because she always wants what she can't have and it'll make her feel a lot better about herself if she can have what Romy has and upset Romy. So do we wanna go for the full on lingerie look? I'm feeling like I really wanna do that just because 
Why not? Let's just go all out, shall we? Where is it? My lingerie at maybe we'll just put it in our lingerie that would make a lot more sense let's put her in this red or bright red black purple I feel like she'd have really nice lingerie so let's go with this one because it's like really pretty colors and she'd wear her hair out absolutely and maybe we should change up her makeup a little bit. Maybe we should go the red. Go the red with red lips. And then that way we can just go a little bit more OTT with a red lip, which kind of, I kind of like that idea. Like that. Yes. <gasps> Very nice girl. Ooh, and we should put on heels. Where my heels at, girl? Uh, where's some sparkly ones? I want sparkly heels. Sparkles, where are you? Here they are. She has become a little bit more curvier since the last part. I'm impressed. I'm glad those cupcakes have been working on her. Me likey. Change outfits. Sleepwear one. <gasps> Where is Taj? Let's go find him. Who's here? Peach is here. What's she doing? Oh, she's just pretending that she's sorority leader. Where is Taj? Where are you? Oh, he's waiting down here. This is perfect. I love this. Okay. Maybe we should go kiss his hands. Go straight for the pudge. No, why are you wearing your track pants? Take them off. <laughs> Sleep one. Oh, well, this will be more dramatic if she strips down in front of him anyway. He's like, what? Whoa, not bad, Nadia. He's thinking twice about Romy. He's like, should I, should I, should I go here? Why not? <laughs> How else should we seduce him? Oh, <gasps> first kiss. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. First kiss. Is he going to go there? Will he go there? Does he respect Romy at all? <gasps> oh my God, Nadia, you are such a... Oh, how could she do that to Romy? Do you feel better about yourself right now, Nadia? She feels kind of bad, but I think she feels pretty good about herself. She's got that crazy eye thing going on, being like, give me attention. Oh my gosh. Let's get them to woohoo. <gasps> no, let's woohoo in the closet. I want to woohoo in the closet. Let's get rid of that. Is it too late to, to change? <gasps> Damn, I wanted them to woohoo in the closet. Does Peach have any idea? Oh my gosh, where is Peach actually? Somewhere around the house. I hope she doesn't catch them. Oh, damn, you guys. <gasps> oh, this is so, so salty. Ew, the bed's like super squeaky. Like they had a little bit of fun. I think what what Nadia would probably do at this stage is be pretty happy with herself. She's feeling very confident, you know. She's got the man that she had her eye on, and she's she feels a lot better now that she can have any guy she likes, even one of the prettiest girls in in the house. Oh, Ecclesley's back. How you going, girl? Um, so uh oh, Ecclesley's not going to be happy about that. Ooh. She's not going to be happy. But what we might do is we might just ask Nadia. She's, you know, she's probably getting hungry after a, after a woohoo. So we're going to ask uh, Taj if he wouldn't mind just fixing the fridge on his way out. I think Nadia would like to say, 
would like to ask him to do a quick favor. You know, she likes getting, she likes delegating. She loves getting people to do things for us. So she'd be like, can you just, uh, please, can you please fix our fridge on your way out? Because I could really go some cupcakes.